You got me. <laughs> That's a beef as a body hip over. This might Is be that... my final question. What up? What up? Ever. Um, Steve will do it of the Nuck Boys. Are you familiar? Steve. Um, yeah, I think I met him once. Small white Steve, guy. That's, he used to be with 6 9 he was friends with him. The other day he went on Instagram and he said that 6 9 is a woman beater. He accused him of hitting his girlfriend with a car. Steve, nah. Steve said all that. Search Steve will do it 6 9 and you'll find role it. Managing for 6 9 They're in some sort of beef. Now, That's I, crazy. I watched Ak talk about it and he was, being, he was keeping it close to his chest exactly what their problem is. But apparently there was some kind of business deal that didn't work out, and Steve feels like in some way 6 9 is responsible for him missing out I'm on money. To, I remember that, dude. I'm not sure why. Um, but see, I'm going to say this. The Steve will do it. Did he know these things prior to him getting upset about whatever he's mad about? Well, I'm, I'm with you on that. And he more than a bitch, than a bitch. Because if you knew these things, these yeah. alleged things are supposed to happen, and you said nothing about it Until, because you're making yeah. money with them or whatever's going on, now all of a sudden you're mad about something. Oh, you're this, 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 and that. Well, if he was these things now, he was that then. So why didn't he say nothing then? I completely agree. I think he capping. Everybody does this to me. He capped it. As soon as we stop working together, ah, he's a rapist. It'll never happen with they, me. They never have that It'll to say never until, happen with me. Uh, until he's after the capping. fact. Yeah. That's cap. I told 6 9 that Steve was a bozo. I remember him now. Really? Because I caught him stealing money. Stealing money? Yeah, I caught him six stealing nine. money. It was a show up in Colorado. Yep, I got the content too. It was a show up in Colorado through my boy AD. He used to, remember AD used to work at K Day? No. He used to be the program director. Uh, I know a different <clears throat> Adrian Scott. Um, mm -hmm. He called me, said, yo, they booked 6 9 on this show. So they called me. I said, it ain't got nothing to do with me. He said, send me the contract. I called 6 9 He said, y'all know about it. I said, what did he tell you? The number he told 6 9 was a total different number he charged them. Then he had the nerve to turn around and say, hey, we could reschedule it, but I need another 20 grand or 10 grand. And they sent it to him. And Steve, then he went dark. Steve was doing all this? Yeah, he did that. I feel he like Steve that. has like an insane amount of money from all that gambling if, and no, streaming if, shit. No, if this is the same dude that used to be on the road with him. I don't think he was on the road with him. He's no, like it was a, a super famous YouTuber who lives in Florida. Yeah, no, it was a dude that used to be on the road with him. If it's the same dude, it's a dude named Steve. If it's the same dude, he did a lot of shit. Steve, now, if it's not, then it's not him. Steve will do it. Yeah, this dude I'm talking about was role managing for 6 9 This dude. 6 9 put him in a few of his uh, videos and shit. No. Yeah, like when they was in Dubai. Remember he did the shit? Maybe some vlogs and stuff. You remember yeah. when he, was he there? Maybe. Yeah, he is. They hang out in Miami and whatnot. I think that's him. Well. Rika would know. Rika would know. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't see... like the fact that, I don't like the fact that, if you knew all these things prior to, like, you seen him hit a girl with a car. Like, come on, bro. Like, like. But if you saw me hit a girl with a car, would you would you go tell TMZ right away? No, I'm gonna stop you. Right. I'm gonna stop you. But then, it, but that's what I'm saying. Like, you wouldn't go rat on me right away. No, but. I'm gonna stop you. And if you needed, if you was a fuck out of line, you gonna know that, bro. You you out of line. I'm not going to hit my girl with a car for the no, record. I'm just saying, like, I would stop you. Like, bro, what the fuck you doing? But, I, like, once we had a conversation, that understanding, there's nothing for me to talk about. Right. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you did? And listen, bro, if y'all handled that, deal with that, there's nothing for you to talk about. Yeah. We need more information. We need to know about the deal that didn't work out with them. Something must have happened. Wh if it's that guy. What is your overall feeling that you've been left with after that TK, uh, TQ Hatch interview? Um, you think he's on the up and up? Or no, we just we just brought him back on Clubhouse yesterday. <clears throat> this is, Bootsy is the bozo. Bootsy is the bozo. I'm gonna tell you why. Wow. Did he sign his brother's name with the revamped contract with him in blue? Yes, he did. Okay. Did Bootsy know he was doing it? Fuck yes. Right. Did he sign other shit prior to for Bootsy? Fuck yes. They've been business too long, right? But Bootsy's um, hate 
or his brother to not to want to see him make any money clouded his mind to a point that he said he forged my name on that contract with Blue, which means this contract is null and void. So you fucked yourself. Oh, he forged it? So that means his contract don't mean nothing. That means us doing business directly with Blue is legal. He fucked himself because with him trying to cut his brother's throat, he cut his own throat. Mm. If he wouldn't have said nothing, he would have still had his lawsuit. But when he said he forged it, like if it's just a no jumper thing, and I forged your name. If they find out I forged your name and this is a contract with whoever, right? Mm. They could say this contract's null and void. It's fraudulent. Whatever's spelled out on this contract doesn't mean anything. You never signed it. Right. So but now. That's actually what happened. That's that, that's this lawsuit it. is going away because. Lawsuit, it's the, gone. It's already gone. It's gone. Just because of one thing that Luther there it said? Goes. Wow. Fucked yourself. He, listen, he didn't want his brother to eat. Uh-huh. That, now, that's crazy. But his brother yesterday, I had to tell him some fucked up shit. I might send you the clip. He was like, you know, I'm always there for Bootsy. When he went to jail in San Diego, I was calling around for attorneys. And try. I said, bro, Bootsy told you he don't fuck with you. Leave him alone. He didn't want to pull back. He finally got it last night. I said, bro, your brother doesn't fuck with you. Yeah, that Don't do clear. anything he doesn't want you to do. That's his right. Leave him alone. Mm. He was like, but, but there's no buts. Motherfucker jumped out on you with a bat. He put you in a lawsuit knowing you got to spend money you don't have. He didn't told the family he don't want to talk to you. Yeah, he clearly doesn't fuck with him. But he's like, well, I'm going to still beat it for my brother. No, leave him alone. Stop trying to go around him. Stop trying to contact him. Right. I mean, when I was having that conversation with him, I started to kind of think that. It's so obvious that whatever relationship he has with Boosie is not working. That Boosie doesn't there, respect he, he him. Don't fuck Boosie with him. Boosie doesn't want to see him win. Boosie doesn't want to do business with him. But it's kind of like he has no choice but to continued to sort of try to utilize the Boosie connection because being close to That's fame is so night. valuable that it's I like he could break off and do his own thing. That's what I but, told him. But then all you really have is just your resume that consists of shit that you did for Boosie earlier. I asked career. him, he said he went and revamped the Badass Entertainment Corporation. Mm. I said, why? That is Boosie's name. Right. Why would you just operate under your the other name? You know why? Because you want to utilize that name for some clout. And Boosie's letting the world know he don't fuck with you. I wouldn't even touch that company, Badass Entertainment. Mm -hmm. When you hear that, you hear Bootsy. So for you to run around under that, that's running around under false pretense. I'm still kicking myself because I wish I had told him that there's actually a new badass in town. Don't say that. The King of Bompton. No, no, bro. Stop playing with that. No? You don't do that. That's, Bompton that's, G, you know? Listen. What? That's a real thing. And dude is a known rat, and you can't be saying that. Well, I don't know anything about that. Yeah, well, I'm letting you know we ain't playing with that. Okay. Well, the King of Bompton throne will remain unfilled at this time. There's a lot of kings. Well, oh, there's Bompton. many kings, yeah. A lot of kings in Bompton, a lot of kings everywhere, San Diego, Sacramento, everything in between, Bequema, Inglewood, Watts. It's a lot of kings. What's up? Like he heard Bompton. Yeah, you're, you're that? Home, that's stuck one his head the, in. That's one of the kings of Bompton. Did somebody say king of Bompton? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, he got a door open. <laughs> All right. Wack 100. Thank you. To the, this week is the Adam and Wack show. Ooh, okay. So you don't give me the same respect. Well, it's cool, though. It's like Siskel and Ebert. They flipped a coin. I never heard the Ebert and Cisco show. No, I don't think they tried to. Cisco and Ebert should be Cisco and Ebert. Cisco and Ebert. It's a better flow. Cisco and Ebert. Beavis, Beavis <laughs> and Budhead should be Beavis and Budhead. Not Budhead and Beavis. Ask Beavis. I get nothing but head. Hey, yo, you always got to say some sexual freak shit.
Oh, it's a big L lyric. Rest in peace. It has in-depth articles about current events, music, etc., plus all of our content in terms of podcasts, interviews, etc. And you can get some exclusive new merch if you check out nojumber.com. So make sure you tap in.